You could help people but like me by not being rude to her. Just like, cause, sorry. Just because we're sat on the street doesn't mean to say we're something that you did. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my birthday. I'm in York, and I just met this lovely man holding a beautiful dog. Called and I, Elsa. Pardon? Elsa. Elsa is your name. No, I'm my dog. Hello, Elsa. And what's your name, sir? James. I'm Danny. I'm nice to meet you, James. This is Jim. Nice to meet you, James. So, James, I want is I ask you, can I make a quick video, not for publicity or anything, just to basically, when people walk past you. Should they fear you? Should they be scared of you? No, no, no. What is your story? What can you say to my fans that could make people think twice when they look at someone like you? And what, not, not what, by being someone like you, but why are you in this position? How can we help? Please help me. Here we go. Well, people could help me by, by not looking. Somebody's got to sit here. And for the grace of God, everybody's free paid this work and they've got it. Yes. So I've had a nice house and a good job and I lost it all through a drink. And the thing that would really help is that if, if I say, can you spare a little change, please? Just say no, or fuck off. Thank you. Just don't ignore me. It's horrible. It doesn't make me feel like a human being. The first thing I said to you was, you look like a talented man to me. You look like you could do anything you wanted, and you look like a talented man. How do you, I'm not saying someone like you, but how easy is it for someone like me to become someone in this position? How easy is it, please? I lost my husband, and within eight months, I'd lost everything. Like, people put milk on the poor cornflakes. I was putting God for a night. That's just how quick it can take you to deteriorate. Could we not say to you, can you not stop drinking now, because maybe it's done enough damage? I ain't had to drink for four years. It nearly killed me. I was on a litre of vodka a day. So I'm an alcoholic, but I ain't had to drink for years. What would you say to someone that has a normal job, lives a normal life, and drinks a bit over the top? How easy can it become a worse situation? Oh, a bereavement, something about your mortgage, something about your car, anything that... If, I'm not materialistic, but people where the whole possessions have gone. If you lose all that, you just make sure you don't start drinking or taking whatever, because they'll just end up like me, being fret like shit, spat at and everything. What about people that think they're doing really well and they kind of earn a bit of money and they do a little bit of cigarettes, a bit of powder, drink a lot because they've got a job? How easy can that turn around for them? Dead easy, dead easy. Before so what would you say, what, what would you say to them people, please? Just... Do, appreciate, don't appreciate. Don't drink, just do not drink. Don't I'll, drink. I've got a bottle of drink in my pocket because I feel like I've earned it and I get stressed out. What would you say to me? What's that? What's in there? Whiskey and Coke. Well, you, you can't anaesthetise yourself against life. But I'm trying, to, I'm trying to basically get away from the things that are bothering me because... Therapy? It's therapy for me because my mum died when I was young. I've been in prison and I've had a hard life. I live yeah. in Jaywick. Yeah. How do I overcome it? Counselling, talk, you need a counsellor. You don't need to find a good counsellor for the NHS. They've done wonders for me. People look up to me and I've got problems myself that people don't know. And I'm that close to losing everything. So what can we say to people? All people, what can we say to them? Get a therapist. You need someone to talk to. If you bottle it all up, it'll just fester. And what can we do to help you? As you just helped me, my friend. Thank you. All right, no, you, you have just helped me. Yeah, I mean no, that. I look in your eyes, I say thank you. Thank you. But what, what can we do to help you, please? Apart from give you a few pounds, because I think you're worth more than that. I think you're worth more than money. Just not, not be rude to me. Just not be rude to me. Just not be rude to me. Thank you. All right, thank you. Amen. This is Danny Sluggett meeting this great man. Shine on. Goodbye. Thank you.